night. So today, um, you can say it's a little um, spice up day. <laughs> if you don't know, I am a cooker. I made my own recipes. Yes, that's true. If you don't know about me the most. So yeah, and the problem that, um, so today, I'll be actually doing something really um, different on this channel that I never did before. Like, never, like never, like I didn't did any, never. So today I'll be doing a different video in this video, in this video. I'll be actually doing a cooking video. Yeah, so this cooking video name is going to be the mac and cheese to be honest i saw a lot of youtube videos making mac and cheese i did watch it but then i got a little confused how to make it well i don't know how to make it i do know how to make it but then i thought i do have some of the things that they showed i do have cheese i do have pasta i do have milk i do have black paper so i thought to make something by myself and make it my recipe so yeah so i'm gonna be sharing this to you guys um so let's just not pasta this type of look and we will be needing two cheese and black paper and last but not least milk With this uh, whole thing and make sure before you boil it make sure to give um, salt and oil that's it and um, I have prepared some of the cheese as you can see we, we used to have that sandwich cheese you can cut I just make them like a dough and then make them apart then it's gonna be more easy to melt up with the pasta and yes that's the one and if you have those mozzarella like pizza cheese you can use them you don't need to cut them you just have to put them that's more easier but if you have this then do it this way do it this way okay so now it's time to make the pasta and ignore all those things okay the first thing you'll be needing is milk so you're gonna make the curry mix and put the high heat put a middle heat okay now put just a little bit don't put a lot we don't need a lot we just need to first make the packer thing and then we will be using the black pepper yes wait wait up a bit we need some black in the middle Put 
medium high heat now we putting some black paper uh, I guess that's enough I think yes that is enough just gonna mix potion to give you this cute and really beautiful look of this so I'm gonna let this boil for a bit you know make it a little taste no wait we're still not done then That's how it's gonna go. Just as your wish, you can put the salt in your test. I'm just gonna mix all that thing up to make sure you make a really thick thing. Like around one minute it's now finally done and if you know you see this texture you just finally see it this is what you will be needing it like this see yes so we are finally done Let's see but now we're not done last thing we will be needing is some chili the red chili As you can see, you can just put a little, just a little, cut with scissors, some little bit, just, you know, a little sprinkle of red pepper, red chili, and it looks really good. But don't put a lot, but it will like, look like, it will even, sorry, you will put something else. So, don't put a lot, just a little, that will just show up a little color, which will make a good smell and a good look. Yes, so we're finally done now. I'm gonna put this in this mug and then we're gonna do these two. let's move on to the pasta now we're gonna make the cheese pasta real one and then we're gonna be putting the uh, milk thing putting the cheese that we have to cut in oh. wait let me just see we have put that up now I do not, I do not. The butter right now, so it's, it, 
instead of butter, I'll be using like um, I'll be using some tea. It's gonna make it a little realistic, and that's gonna help it out. Okay, now. Stick together. Okay, now good. You can see we can see the texture of that well. So now we can put in our main thing. This. We're putting this. Put this on. Ooh, up the milk thing. Now I think it smells so beautiful, so good. I'm just dead with the smell. And now what you have to do? You have to lick it, soak with the pasta, and then you will be set and done. Some nuts, and then you're done.